Back in, I believe it was 1985, there was a car accident on Main Street and a young woman was injured and there was no ambulance in this town. And they had to wait, I believe it was at least 30 minutes for an ambulance to respond. Well, not much happens in a small community, but when it does, it's really, really important to have somebody close because since we're so far away from other big towns, it takes forever for people to show up for accidents. It's really cool that they're so close that when an emergency happens, you know that they're right there. And those people that were with her had decided that this is not going to happen again in this town to anyone else. And so they worked very hard to start an ambulance in this town. And it's very difficult to start a service. matter of life and death a lot of times. It's very, very important. If you have an emergency, you're always you know, somebody like right down the block who can call for help and they'll get everybody together. It's like everybody's kind of part of some kind of emergency team. So much talent, so much knowledge, and so much caring that you might not get in a big city. I'm not saying that they don't care, but they don't have time to develop the relationships. Okay, like when, when my son-in-law needed them, when my daughter needed them, they knew instantly who it was. Uh, so their hearts are also, you know, not just their knowledge, their hearts are But they put everything they had into it and at that time there were not a lot of volunteers and they took a lot of call time and so it started out very small but it has grown and built we've got some wonderful volunteers and they do they um, they don't just do fire and mass they're involved in the community in other ways We just continue to grow and expand and our skill sets are growing. We now have um, ALS services, which is Advanced Life Care Services, and so we can provide beyond your initial first day. It does involve a lot of my life, in fact that's you know, what I do. But it's more than just a job for myself and for those that I serve with. It is taking care of our neighbors and our family. And it's an opportunity that's presented to us that I wouldn't dream of doing anything else. It's what I'm passionate about. I get to help my friends, my neighbors, and family. And it's a privilege to be in their moment of crisis that they're asking us for help. And so it's an honor to serve my community in that way.